Now, it's been a few weeks, Emily, yeah. since we've brought everyone women in sports. Yes, and we love our women in sports. Yes. Women power. Mm. Yes. <laughs> we were waiting for the perfect time, or the perfect ice. Yes, and now that the ice has frozen over, we took a ride to Riverworks and met up with the Hawks. Check this out. Coach Klubeck, how are you? I'm doing great, how are you? Oh my God, well, I'm cold. <laughs> <laughs> I'm cold. But women's ice hockey at the collegiate level. Let's talk about a little bit of your history. Tell us a little bit. Uh, so I spent 10 years in the United States Air Force. So it's actually my fifth year anniversary of being out. Uh, I coached Little League uh, ice hockey in Louisiana, college hockey in Mississippi, professional women's ice hockey in Germany, mm -hmm. uh, also in Wyoming. And then I was the hockey director down in Miami before taking the job here. Wow, thank you for your service. Oh, thank you. Um, so let's talk about how important it is to highlight women in sports. We hardly ever talk about women in ice hockey. How important is it to highlight this? Uh, well, one, I mean, the game is growing tremendously. And two, it's important to remember that they're athletes, not just women. Mm -hmm. So when I look at my team, I'm like, this is a team of strong hockey players. Uh, and I think it gets lost in some other sports where it might not be treated the same, but I want to make sure that my players get the same respect that any other team would. I love that. I love that. And let's talk about how this game prepares them for life. Yeah, let's talk about that. Yeah, uh, there's not really a penalty box in the game of life, but there are some setbacks that can happen. It's all about how you bounce back from it. Um, I'm a big believer that not everything happens right away, and hockey's that way. It's a first year program, not everything great's gonna happen this year, but it's something that we can build towards. Yeah, but you have plans though, right? Oh, I have plans. <laughs> you got big plans, yeah. You have plans. Um, how proud are you of these young women? So my team right now is playing with half a roster. Today we're going up against a team in the top 20. Uh, so I know what they're facing. They know what they're facing. They're starting to go out and battle for 60 straight minutes. There's there's no word that even comes close to the word for proud, but this team is just a, a team that likes to conquer everything that they're given, and I love that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. To a young woman that is thinking, you know what, I think I want to try that one day. What would you say to her? Do it. Why, why not try something if you're interested in it? Uh, I played college football, I played college lacrosse and college hockey. Why not try everything? You're, you're only given one chance to do it, right? I think we learned that this week as Bill fans with Damar. And yep. uh, I say try whatever you want to try. Coach, thank you so much for being an inspiration. Thank you. How are you, Tia? I'm good, how are you? I'm good. So Tia, how long have you played uh, ice hockey? Um, I've been playing for about 10 years now. 10 years? What? do you love the most about playing ice hockey? Um, I love playing for my friends and family and like making a lot of new connections with new people. Yeah, and you play for Hilbert College. What is that like? It's awesome. It is the most hardworking group of girls you'll ever find. Yeah, awesome. and what's the, what's the most exciting part of the games for you? Um, knowing that I get to help out my team and hopefully secure a win. Yeah, I hear you have an awesome Grade point average, too. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? At 3.9. Oh my God, congratulations. Thank you. How do you balance that with sports? Um, just making sure that I make time to like get my schoolwork done and also focus on like staying in shape and working out for my team. Yeah. How important do you think it is that women's sports are highlighted right alongside men's? It's super important because I think women's is growing up to like the same level as guys hockey and so being able to see it broadcasted the same way is awesome. Yeah. Are there any special things you ladies do before the games to get ready? Um, I juggle for my hand-eye coordination and then I stretch a lot. Well, we like go for warm-up, we sing a lot of songs together, we have dance parties. Yeah. Anything to keep the energy up. Yeah. Fun. And there is a young lady watching this right now that is saying to herself, you know what, I want to do what Tia is doing. Are there any words of encouragement that you can give her? Um, I would just say, like, believe in yourself. If you think you can do it, the chances are that you can. And um, just, yeah, have faith that everything's going to work out the way you want it to. Thank you, Tia. 